Hello everyone, how are we all doing today? Well, today I'm on the HD camera uh, this time. It's been a while since I last posted an HD video. So I have a little shout out to give to. Um, you can see Sagittarius201, uh, one of my Polish subscribers. Uh, he's asked me to give him a little shout out, so check out his channel. And if you go to it, it is uh, mainly teas. Sweet. Alrighty, so I think this is the last video we will see the teas in this order. <laughs> We're almost uh, completed the tea room, so I'll be showing it to you when it's completely done. Here's uh, an update of uh, Joel. Uh, it's very hard to see. Uh, Piornata, female. She's doing really awesome. Haven't fed her yet. We're going to be planning soon. Yeah, she's right there. It's like a six inch female. Or close to seven, actually. And uh, here's a P. Metallica, female, mature male. He's going to go to uh, Arachnoholic 420. Uh, his friend and uh, my TRKT is also going to be leaving okay so today's video is uh, many people have asked me to give a care sheet video of the Jenny Carcass uh, Quadratus the Halloween crab so I guess I'll this is from my experience of keeping this crab for quite some time got about like uh, almost a month ago uh, from the expo oh, yeah, he really messed up his enclosure but anyway so uh, this is what he's in now this is a typical uh, setup of a Halloween crab what I do is I put some eco earth that's the one that comes in the brick filled it out about uh, I would say about three quarters of the way because these are burrowing ones so I have a really big and deep uh, shallow water dish because uh, they do have gills and they do need to uh, wet them from time to time. Uh, feeding habits, I usually feed them uh, once every other day. I give them um, a variety of fruits and vegetables and all, you can also buy those pellets. I haven't bought those pellets yet. But uh, yeah, he's in the he's in the dark here chilling. Um, I don't think he likes broccoli so I think he prefers like lettuce and fruits and veggies. I'm gonna give him an apple see how he likes it but he's doing great he's awesome keeps me up in the little middle of the night ever since he had his old enclosure and uh, now since I bought this new one I got this for my birthday actually my brother designed this cage for me and uh, ever since that he was like completely quiet he likes to hide under his cave which is good I see him uh, swimming a couple times and uh, yeah he's pretty cool so I don't really know how often, how long they live. I'm assuming um, five to six years, not uh, 15 years or 30 years compared to a tarantula. But uh, it's really awesome to get one. He's my favorite. Something different for a change. Yeah. So just uh, keep them uh, in a bigger exoterra uh, enclosure. Did you get from a pet store? Buy some uh, eco worth. I think about one brick should cover the whole thing by a little big water dish so we can just swim there and wet their lungs their gills sorry and uh, well this is just optional so yeah that's my little setup of the uh, Halloween crab and it's a uh, small care sheet hope you enjoyed it and uh, thanks for watching